Hi, my name is Fernando, and I'm going to show you um, a little trick about um, your startup uh, entries in, on the Mac OS. So, a quick way to find out what's actually starting up um, on your Mac is here's here's a couple of them that shows me it gives me an indication that there's a few items that are starting up. Now, it's okay that some of them are starting, but uh, I can remove a few of them, and uh, that's what we'll go ahead and do. It's better not to have them starting. Starting, you you can actually call a program and not need it to have run in the background. So um, let's do this. So I'm going to hit the Apple space bar and I'm going to go to System Preferences and I'm going to go to Accounts and this is usually specified by the user that's actually uh, logged on to the uh, Mac OS. So I'm going to go into login entries. As you can see here, I have the Growl Helper app, Air Mouse Server. I'm going to keep Air Mouse Server. Uh, I'm going to remove VMware Fusion Helper, iTunes Helper, and HP Event uh, Handler. I don't need to be notified by the HP printer that my black ink is low. Um, I can figure it out after a while. Um, so let's do that. Uh, in order for me to do that, uh, in order for me to remove startup entries, I have to um, uh, have admin access. So let me just type in my password. I'm going to go into login entries and I'm going to remove uh, VMware Fusion, iTunes Helper, and EHP Event Handler. So I'm going to just click the minus. It's going to say, Are you sure you want to remove? Click OK. I'm going to also uh, highlight uh, iTunes Helper and the VMware Fusion. Uh, Task-wise, I can kill that too. Uh, Growl Helper, uh, I can kill that. The only two real applications that I need running is the Air Mouse server and the Dropbox. Um, and that's pretty much it. But by doing this, I've killed up, I've killed those uh, those applications from starting as soon as I log on. It's a nice little tip uh, to kind of just remove those things and um, yeah. Good luck and have fun. All right. Thanks. Bye.